All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to some more Hitman 3, and this is part four. Thank you for all the support so far. It means a lot. I appreciate it. Let's keep it up above 100 likes per part. That would be ideal. We might do two missions in this video. Um, it's called End of an Era and The Fur Farewell. The Farewell? <laughs> the Farewell, and then we have Untouchable as the last mission. Uh, but I'm really excited to get into it. Uh, the missions so far have been great. I feel like On Top of the World was awesome. And then it got even better with this Death in the Family mission. And then the Apex Predator one was okay. I didn't I didn't think that one was one of the better missions so far. It was the worst one for sure out of the three. Um, but it was still fun. Um, but we're going to do End of an Era now. And uh, please do show some support. Make sure to subscribe to the second channel as well. It would mean a lot. Let's jump in and do this thing. I'm uploading the Spec Ops ending over the next day maybe as well so let's jump in we have to take out hush and we have to take out image and royce we actually watched the cutscene for this at the end of the last part but yeah i'm gonna make this hitman series five parts in total uh whether we do two missions in this video or the next one i'm not sure yet here we are this city is big brother's wet dream with more than 2.5 million cameras covering 15 million people privacy is a four-letter word in this place it's pretty ironic that a cloak and dagger organization like the ICA keeps its most valuable secrets here. You'll find Hush conducting his fringe experiment in an abandoned apartment building. While Imogen Royce, the archivist, runs the day-to-day -day business of the ICA data facility. I just hope you know what you're doing, 47. Me too. I hope I know too. Otherwise, we're in big trouble. This place is beautiful. God damn. Look at that. This city is stunning. China. You are beautiful. Hack data core, unavailable, eliminate all targets. We gotta eliminate Hush and Imogen in a quick space of time, right? I think is what we have to do. Do we have any missions, uh, mission stories at the moment? All seeing eyes, certainty principle, and impulse control. That one looks cool. Let's try impulse control. Where's that at? 177 meters that way, good lord. Okay, we're, ha we're traveling. But no better place to travel in. This is the first AAA game I've played on PC in a very long time. And I got to say, like, I'm impressed with the graphics at Man 3. And um, this is on my new PC, of course. And, uh, yeah, I'm just really ha in a good place right now. In terms of video games, in terms of the channel, everything. Um, I was in a dark place there for a while, but I'm very happy at the moment. And uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying the content. Let's get it done. Hey, can I get under this umbrella with you, lady? No, she doesn't like that. She just... Yeah, you don't. You're right. You're right. If I was you, I would do the same thing, especially when I look like this. A bald serial killer is what I look like. So I don't blame her one bit. Not even one bit. Wait, there's something we can take a picture of here? This car, maybe? We take a picture of the car's registration? Yes. Okay. And what is that for? May I ask? A rental car. A car rented in the name of Angus Pritchard. Okay. That's something to keep an eye on then. Those guys are blocking off something. Ah, oh, my knee is so sore. Why is that? I fell over because a homeless woman suddenly jumped up right in front of me. She was <laughs> hiding in a hole with cardboard covering her. I nearly stepped right through. Wow. So I was laying... Wow! <laughs> then she started yelling something about me stealing her past. What's that about? I saw another one pounding a stone to the pavement. Right, okay. Homeless people be wild then, I guess. I'm just playing Yakuza like a dragon as well, and the homeless people in that are awesome. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna be rich. Get the hell out of here. I got this flyer, and it says I can make a lot of money to be in some experiment. Oh, God. You don't want people like us for that sort of thing. No, they only want people like us. The flyer says so. That means it's too dangerous for rich people. Don't do it. Oh, I'm going. This is my chance. I just need to find out where it is. Uh, the flyer has a symbol I need to find on the building. That's got Hush written all okay. over it. Using the desperate for personal gain. Maybe this is a way for you to get to the bastard. I think so. I think it could be. Disguise yourself as a homeless person. I'm gonna have to subdue this poor homeless man, huh? Good lord, this is terrible. <laughs> good, Thank you. I'm not gonna be looking good in a second because I'm gonna be looking like you. <laughs> Secluded location if possible. I think he's going to one right now. This should be perfect. And we'll be able to disguise ourselves as him. There's no one down here. Yeah, there's not. I can take him out here. 
I'm sorry, man. Wait, who noticed it? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. I am so sorry, guys. I, do I did not mean to kill the homeless man. I did not mean to kill the homeless man, bro. I just snapped his fucking neck. I just snapped his neck. I'm so sorry. I am so, so sorry, dude. Oh my god, I didn't mean that at all. I ju I was talking about Agent 47 being a serial killer, and then I just- Oh my goodness. Alright guys, so I just decided to restart the mission. That went horribly wrong very quickly. I snapped the homeless man's neck. It's just not- in, in front of people as well. It was never gonna go well from there, so I just- re I restarted the mission. Uh, I'm gonna wait a second to subdue him now, because that guy across the road is watching. That's what we needed to be careful of, I'm pretty sure. Um, so... Yo, what's up, peeps? How you guys doing? I'm gonna be rich. Rich, you hear? Then you won't look at me like I'm filled. No, you won't. You like me. I'm not looking at you. I know what you're thinking. <laughs> but who's gonna be on top then, huh? So, please act normal. Please act normal. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Uh, I'm trying to act normal. Um, if he if he comes over here, I can subdue him over here, I think. No, there's a woman with an umbrella coming in now. Bro, my game's bugged. So these guys just keep coming back to talk to him, but the conversation goes nowhere and they just stand here and nothing happens. Do I have to fucking subdue all three of them? Is that what they want me to do here? I don't understand it. Like, I really don't. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking kill all of you. You guys deserve it. Come on, then. Come on, then. You guys want it all? You guys want it all? Ah! Come on! It was so stupid. It was just not working at all. Like, come on, game. I literally had to just kill all three of them. That's what I just did. And they're searching for me now. I'm probably compromised. And it might not work. But at the same time, it was the only option I had right there. It was legit the only option I had, which is crazy. It was just completely bugged. I would have to st restart the mission again. And I did not want to do that at all. Look at the neon lights, man. This looks beautiful. Gotta say. And I think the entrance to the place we gotta go is over here, if I'm not mistaken. I should drop my gun. They found the body, but I don't even care at this point. Like, I really don't. Alright, um, where should I drop my gun? That people won't notice me doing so. I don't think there's anyone around here. I'm just gonna drop my gun here. Because they want to frisk me in here. Um, which I know because... Uh, I'd done this part, and then it all went horribly wrong. Oh, I can conceal an item there. Fucking hell. Well, that makes things easier. I could have just done that. <laughs> that would be better. Let's conceal the item in the garbage can. There you go, and we, we can get that on the way out then, if need be. Let's go. Yeehaw, buddy. Hi there. Looking Hi. Good, Let's get you out of the rain, Looking shall good. we? Thank you. I appreciate that, man. <laughs> uh, well, this is awkward. Hi there. What's Stay awkward? Rain, shall we? What's awkward? What the hell's happening? Just need to frisk you. This mission is just bugging for me, straight up. Okay, I'm okay. Now I'm following you, right? Listen, sir. There's no drama. Just need to check your pockets if you want to pass. Yep, frisk me, bro. I ain't got shit. This is just standard procedure. No worries, mate. It's all good. I ain't got nothing. I ain't got nothing. All right. Well, good job, sir. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I wonder, could I go out and get my gun now? What's that smell? Probably it's not. You. It's you. <laughs> wow. Understand it. Your clothes are so filthy, I can literally taste the stench. When did you last change your outfit? Seriously. I change my clothes all the time. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> hey, I don't have much of an option, pal. I'm homeless. In there. Go take a seat. They'll get you and the other guys to sign up. Okay. ...is part of the agreement when signed. And you waive all future rights to seek further compensation. Hey there. Yes. Who would oh. you like to benefit from the proceedings? Hey, buddy. Sorry. I thought you were someone else. Would you excuse me? No, nope, not me. Oh, so Hush likes the last one I sent up to the top floor. Ooh. He'll be the one to conclude this phase. Fuck. I knew Hush would be pleased with this. He signed up for the full package. Strong, too. I'll wrap up down here. Thanks, Jun Lee. I was just informed that we don't need any more time. Oh, come on! I don't understand. There's no work? Oh, no. There will be more to come. Depending on the results of the conclusion to this test phase, come back tomorrow, and we'll schedule a new spot for you. 
Well, that's unfortunate. Not gonna be able to do shit. Unless we're going for a different... I don't know. Okay. Didn't you just say there'd be no... Okay, yeah. ...test subjects will need for tonight. But you're welcome to fill in your information now and come back tomorrow. A guard is waiting outside the door. He'll escort you out of the building when you're done. Help yourself to an apple. Fear trouble. I do need my vitamins. Okay. Find the test subject on the top floor. Okay. Let's take an apple. Meet it. So, I want you to escort the subject out of the building when he comes out. Understood. Oh, we can go up to the top floor somehow. Me? Okay, yeah, come on, let's go. All right, I'm gonna kill him. Follow me. All right, I'm following you. I, I need somewhere to take him out. Is there anywhere I can take him out and stuff his body? God damn it. I don't know if this is gonna work. I feel like this isn't gonna work, bro. Where can I put his body, though? That's the problem here. That's the biggest problem with all this. I don't have anywhere to put his body. Oh, Jesus. We have to leave it here. We have to leave it here. Okay. Now we can get up, surely. It's gonna take the fiber wire. And where do I go? Where do we go from here? All right, maybe I have to get through here somehow. He's asleep, so... This isn't where we need to go. Fuck. Hmm. I don't know about this one, Chief. We're trespassing now. Right, how do we get up? Ah, we can go up the pipe! Let's go! How far up can we go? Only this far, unfortunately. But, we're high enough, enough up, we just need to get up one more floor and we're good. We're still trespassing though, so... Oh, we need to unlock that. What about this? Do I need a crowbar? No. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus, this is terrible. Okay? I don't know if that's good. Alright, we gotta wait for him to turn around and somehow get through here unspotted. I feel like I should save it. Here, but, but I think it's auto safe. Everybody stay calm. Stay calm. We're good. Let's go. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's two guys there. There's a guy here. Holy shit. What are we doing here, guys? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Holy shit, how do we get away with that? How do we get away with that? Can I take this disguise? Holy shit, we got his disguise and everything. They're gonna find that body, though. Oh, God. How do we get away with that? Alright. I think we're up here now. Oh, shit, one of them can see me. Can notice me, rather. Alright, we're good. Woohoo! Oh... Uh. Do I want to get recorded by this? I'll try avoid to. I did avoid that. That's nice. Okay. I've come to escort this. Oh, this guy knows me though. Oh That's shit! It. Hush is right there. Hush, the bastard. Wow. Bro, I have an idea. He looks a lot older. I'm gonna shoot him, and then just run. You got the bastard, Hush. Now go get Imogen Royce, and you can get to the. Oh Jesus! Oh no, this was a terrible idea. I'm going out the window. I'm going out the window that I, can't, that I went out there a second ago. That's why I decided- I forgot this wasn't a silenced weapon, bro. I forgot this was not a silenced weapon. That was not smart. Jesus Christ, man. Woo! <laughs> Let's go! We're out of here, baby! I need to find a new disguise, though. Jesus Christ. Get out here now! Shut up. Yeah, you will. Don't lie to me. 
Can I drop all the way down? No. Okay. There's no way down yet. I have to keep going through uh, and all the way out. Oh, shit. If I had a crowbar, I could break that. That would be fucking perfect, man. Is there a crowbar around here? No. There's got to be some one somewhere because there's a lot of stuff that I need a crowbar for at the moment. We're compromised. Oh, and the camera's there. Fuck me. We need to go through this one. Oh my god, how are we doing this? How are we doing this? I don't know. Let me get a different disguise. I can, maybe I can get my disguise back from when I killed this guy out here. Oh, that could be ideal. Yes. Yes, sir. Is this the way out? I think it is. I think it is. There's the crowbar, too, for fuck's sake. Could have done with that a while ago there, lads. All right, I'm out of here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't think I can go that way. I think it's safer to go the other way, honestly. There's two guys here. I don't even want to risk that. Let's go the other way. Can I go out the window? Oh, yes, I can. Yes. All right, I'm going to get rid of this gun. Because that one is um not one that we want. I would prefer to have uh, the silenced one, to be honest. Now, let us go and try and get Imogen Royce. That was a nice one. I, I think we've done it pretty well. I mean, it was messy uh, on the way out, but overall, we didn't do too bad, really. Like, we did okay. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm happy with it. And Hush is dead. That's the main thing, right? All right, so the only mission story available to us right now is Certainty Principle. I'm actually drinking a Red Bull instead of Monster. I've tried, I'm trying Red Bull because it's smaller. If Monster had smaller cans, I would be all over that shit, man. I don't know why they don't. It's weird. All right, 61 meters up this way, there's something we can do? Let's have a look. Let's have a look, okay? I think I was around here before, actually, when I was trying to run, run away at the start. Can I go in here? Yeah. It's a good job, I think you. Hi, I'm Kenzie. Pleased to meet you. I'll be your guide on the facility tour. Okay. Spare me the pleasantries. I've had an awful flight. Nine hours delayed, luggage lost somewhere along the way, and the airline is trying to avoid their responsibility. I'm hungry and I'm tired, and I want to straighten everything out before I'm doing your tour. Yes. Okay. I'm so sorry about your flight. Just so, someone is here for a tour of the facility. Might be a way to get in. Okay. That could work. Oh, when you're ready. Oh, did you bring the P41 we left for you in the apartment? No. I wasn't informed that I should. Oh, very sorry, Mr. Pritchard. We need you to bring the P41 to get the tour. It's procedure. Please pick it up before you come and find me. I'll be waiting by the stairs in the back of the restaurant kitchen. Okay. Got to find out where he's living. Find the P41 form. True to form. Alright, they, are they telling me where it is? Oh, I guess so. Do I have to blend in as him? He has access to the kitchen. I'll be waiting for him in the back. Understood. Hey, hurry up. The man is starving. Yes, I'll see to it. Okay. You think I could kill this guy? In here? Poison him or something? Imagine I just subdue him right here. Bro, honestly... I nearly could. There's no one here. There's, there's genuinely no one here. I could do it. I don't think I need to. I don't think I need to. Now nah, that that would be way too risky. All right, let's just go get the uh, get the form if we can. I would not. I would prefer not to be homeless while we're trying to do it. I don't know if it makes a difference really, but it would be better if I wasn't. I'm guessing. Is this it? Oh, yes, we can get into this window here. Perfect. Okay, that works. Maybe we can steal one of his outfits, too. That would be ideal if we could do that, too. But I don't rightly think so. Let's just get the form. Your message? Answering machine? Okay. Let's hear his message. Hello, Mr. Pritchard. I've just learned that your plane will be delayed beyond the lifetime of the entry code you received for the facility. For your convenience, we've set up the new code to be 0118 to match the one for the apartment. Okay. I hope you enjoy your stay. 0118. Hi, Chanting here. 
Mr. Pritchard, I'm just calling to tell you to bring your P41 for the facility tour. Thank you. Mm. Mr. Pritchard, I just read your report and share your concerns regarding facility leadership behavior. I fully back your decision to inspect, and I would appreciate updates on your initial findings as they come in. Good job. Okay. Oh. Right, now we do have to disguise ourselves as him. Shit. Okay. I thought that time might come, so... We just need to find a way to do it. Yup, I have a Matic rat poison. I'm gonna put that in his food. Potentially. I have a- I have an idea. Not sure it's gonna work, but I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try to take this guy out. Okay, now we got the disguise. We got rat poison. Yeah, I'm, I'm preparing the food. I'm gonna poison it. And then bring it out. Matic rat poison. Boom, boom, boom. I gotta move this body, though. I gotta move this body, though, 100%. Otherwise, we're in big trouble. Can I troll him out? Oh. No, 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 don't, don't! Don't do that! He's gonna see. Oh, for fuck's sake. That's just terrible. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah, uh, looked, like looked like an accident. That's good. At least they think it's an accident. Disguise yourself as the board member. Can I bring this plate of food out? No? Yep, you bring that food out, buddy. Alright, eat up, Nappa. Yeah, okay. He doesn't feel so good. I'm gonna come to the toilet. I'm gonna make sure the door is closed. I'm gonna eliminate him. This time I'm not gonna throw him out the window, though. <laughs> Because that obviously didn't work. Here he comes. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. It's the way of the road. It's the way of the road, pal. I need to be you, sir. I wonder if he's going to die from the poison. I don't think he's going to die. I think, um... I love the way we're just a completely different person and they just never, never know. It's great. But it is what it is. <laughs> okay, body's hidden. Let's go. Let's go talk to this lady, and let's go take out Imogen Royce if possible. Hey, lady, how we doing? I'm let's do this to tour. The facility now. Good. I hope you enjoyed the food. It was Did just you delicious. Forty-one. We left for you in the apartment. Yes, I have everything I need. Good. Let's continue the tour. Continue, let's. You may say, we haven't even started the tour yet. True. But we have. Good one. Without you even noticing it, Mr. Pritchard, invisibility is the best security there is. You see, the Raptor is, in fact, a front that lets all ICA personnel arrive unseen. Who Where's the body? A dumpling cook on his way to work. Dressing the part takes you a long way. ICA guarantees absolute discretion to. What was the code again? We take that promise very seriously, as you will see on all steps of the tour. She's gonna put it in for us, thankfully. Because I was gonna say, I can't remember that shit at all. Come Ladies on, first? It's this way inside. Okay, I'll go first then. Let's go. I'm ready, guy. Let's do this. Imogen Royce, I'm coming for you, baby. Much, does it? Yes, it doesn't, no. Ms. Chen and visitor, welcome. Please report to security desk for visitor sign-in. Will do. <laughs> Pretty impressive, I gotta say. The facility AI is really looking out for us. And we're in. The inside is a self-contained modular build. This is gonna be a nightmare to get out of. Removed in less than 12 hours if we are compromised. No trace we will ever hear. I agree. Leaving no trace behind is the only sensible MO. The outside shell is a building marked for demolition. We've put a hold on it with city planning. A deliberate misplacement of the order. But have people in place to rectify that. At first shift, city construction will move in. Hey. Our policy around ICA personnel is that they are a resource, but also a risk. On top of contractual repercussions, it breaches a... I'm just going to take some photos. We want Mr. Richard, so we can get things rolling. There you go. 
Thanks. I'll get the procedure started. I have a gun though. So feel free to have a look around. I'll meet you on the other side of the frisk. Naturally, you'll have to be frisked like everyone else. Yeah, need to get rid of this gun. Okay, I'm just gonna go conceal this gun. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Completely fine. I conceal my gun. No one saw that. No one saw anything. I think I don't have anything else, right? Everything else is legal. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Now, let us get frisked. Let Hello, me in, boys. Sir. Hello, fellas. Frisk me up, baby. Funny. Pat me down. I always said I had good hands. Said I should have been a surgeon. Okay, don't say that shit when you're frisking me, man. That's just weird. Thank you for your patience, sir. No worries, man. and engage the zero protocol. VIP. I'll get right on it. Is this the way I'm coming? There's no way you're getting through that door 47. It only opens for people with an authentic security clearance. Mm. The signal is encrypted. Without a dongle, we can't hack it. Okay. So we either need to get a, hang a dongle by taking out this lady, maybe, or... I don't know. You're here. I'm you here. Started the security clearance process. It will take a little while since you're covered by the zero protocol. All your data will be encrypted and inaccessible without your authorization. Only facility AI will use it for ID analysis. Fully anonymized, of course. But we can go a few more steps on the tour while it's validating. Okay. ID analysis. What the hell does that mean? That's not good, though. Give me a minute. I'll try to find out. Yeah, you're gonna need to hack some shit As to make I sure said, I'm this dude. Personnel is the greatest asset, but also the greatest risk of the ICA. The work we do here exerts high-level pressure on our employees, and there is no room for mistakes. We perform a daily, multi-layered, full-body scan to guarantee that no employee will act erratically because of PTSD or other mental issues, drug use, physical health issues, external pressure, or moral hesitancy. The scan only takes a few seconds. Come on, it's this way inside. Oh, this is bad. Can I do this? Am I going to be able to pass this? I think I'll be okay. This way? I'm sorry, but we can't proceed beyond this room until your security clearance is finalized. So why don't you have a little look around while we wait, Mr. Pritchard? It should be here shortly. Okay. Shit. We need to intercept that 47, or the facility AI will blow your cover. Get me into one of those computers and do it fast. You've got 60 seconds before all hell breaks loose. Okay. This one? Access granted. Oh shit. Is that... Oh, that guy's gonna see it, is he not? I'll wait for him to pass, wait for him to pass, wait for him to pass. Go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Come on. There you go. Holy shit, did we do it? Good. I'm in. Okay. And you're safe. That was a close one. Alright. Let's go. We good to go, lady? Perfect timing. Your clearance just came through. Must continue. Yeah, it did, baby. Come on, it's this way inside. All right, I'm coming. So, as you see, we are very serious about security. Okay. What we protect is, after all, core to all ICA operations. We and we alone store all legal work, contracts, target profiles, employee files, contract documentation and validation, and so forth. Furthermore, we handle all current operations, effectuate logistics of personnel and equipment. Our analysts do the client vetting, target profiles, and of course, offer real-time contract support to handlers and operators. Storage and transmission of sensitive information like that takes constant vigilance to keep safe. There she is. We have a team of engineers solely dedicated to that task. And oh, good. There she is. That's Hi, Imogen, Imogen Royce. Royce. Quite the bitch, apparently. Likewise. Nothing wrong with her look, though. Edgy. Right? She's edgy. Yeah, am I supposed to follow her now? Okay. <laughs> How are we gonna do this, bro? After you. Thank you. Okay. This is the blast and EMP shielded call room, the nervous system of the ICA. Shit, he's coming after us. I thought maybe I'll be able to push her in here. 
In general, only a handful of people can access this room. Hush and myself, plus bodyguards, and a chosen few of the engineers. Okay. I'm the most likely person to meet in here because I perform a regular physical check-in on the core console as a supplement to the remote authentication procedure. All right then. Sounds cool. Pretty high-tech yes, place, to be fair. Daily core maintenance. Part of that procedure is a flash process evaporating all biological matter in the room. You can see Reed through that window. It's her job to initiate the maintenance. Don't worry, we're safe as long as the safety mechanism is engaged. Even if Reed presses the button, the procedure will not happen until we leave the core room. The doors to the core room are all equipped with... Okay. Unsafe at the core, the managers of, of the facility have installed a safety mechanism in the core, which works as a failsafe for the core cleansing procedure. It's there to make sure no one is inside the, the core as the cleansing starts. Great. This tour. I know why you're really here. Cutting to the chase, I see. Knowledge is power. More importantly, knowledge is opportunity. Opportunity. You have a sixth sense for irregularities. And although Hush's recent behavior has not been reported, it has no doubt brought you here. You do have authority to shut down unwanted efforts, but at heart, you are progressive and not the stickler everyone thinks you are. You have sway with the board, and as I see it, your opinion is now what decides my future and the future of the ICA. So here we go. Imagine this. Having a time schedule on a target with minute details on locations, durations, and purpose. A detailed layout of a target's actions within a defined time frame. That would transform a contract into a surgical dance of precision. No mess, no fuss, low cost. Just how I like it. I've been working on a prediction that algorithm works. based on a combination of big data analysis and micro-targeted surveillance of defining target markers. And my results are astounding. All this state of the art is nothing but heavy old fashioned machinery compared to what I offer. Analysts preparing detailed files, dedicating days, weeks to prepare our contracts, gone. Handlers and analysts supporting our operatives during missions, gone. Teams for cleanup and media manipulation in the rare case something unforeseen does happen, all gone. of it gone. All I of it gone. To imagine that scenario. But what good is imagination when you can see it with your own eyes? I've set up a little demonstration for How you. How are you today, sir? I'm good, sir. Thank you. Three employees unaware that I can accurately predict their behavior. Firing them will result in an already clearly defined reaction. On the top left, we have Sharon Reed, who you saw downstairs. She is a dutiful and trusted employee. If she is to be fired, my algorithm predicts with a certainty of 97.8% that she will finish up her most important tasks before she leaves the building. Specifically, she will press the maintenance button within 11 seconds. Jeremy Bolt. The guard in the lower left is as tough as nails when on duty, but in private, he's a real mummy's boy. If fired, he will immediately call his mother and at her advice, seek out who he considers his best friend for support. My personal guard, as it stands. Me? Really? <laughs> well, explains why he's always next to me at lunch. At the top right, you see Alicia Reynolds. Bright and very passionate about her job. Okay. However, also very possessive about her contribution. My prediction is that she will try to disable the work she has done for the ICA. If she's not allowed to enjoy her results, no one is. Specifically, that means she will try to enter the core room and disable the safety mechanism. I'll leave you to consider your choice of who you want me to use for the demonstration. Just let the guard outside the door know when you're ready, and I'll be right back. I will have a closer look. Maybe your project could play a part in the future of the ICA. Just let the guard outside the door know when you're ready, and I'll be right back. Oh, and if you decide to leave the room, a guard will escort you around. Safety protocol. Thought I'd just mention it. She really takes a term okay. complex to a whole new level. Sitting in there pulling the strings like that. So what do I do? I think you should take her setup and give it a spin, 47. I see potential if you time it right. If I time it right? Okay. So... Make sure to arrange a secondary bodyguard before firing. Alicia Reynolds only fire if Jeremy Bolt is at his post. And Sharon Reed under no circumstance can the safety mechanism be off when she is fired. 
So if we do this right, right, if we fire Jeremy first, he wouldn't be at his post. And then we fire Alicia Reynolds. Um, and then she'll turn off the safety mechanism. And then Sh we fire Sharon Reed and she'll press the button, right? Isn't that what would happen? Jeremy Bolt. I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. <laughs> Thank you for your service. What? That can't be right. Code 41 is confirmed effective for your employment status. Oh, God. <laughs> Poor guy. I feel bad. We're just fire, straight up firing people here. Okay, he's leaving. Wait, no, he's calling. He's going to call his mother first. Then he's going to leave. And then we'll fire Alicia. Alicia? Alicia, Alicia Reynolds? <laughs> I have no idea. I thought it was going really well. I like it here. I can't believe it. Okay. But who, though? Friend. Oh, you mean Vincent? Yeah. Yeah, I'll go see him then. Okay, I'll call you later. Okay, he's gonna leave now. And then we're gonna fire Alicia. Alicia? Okay, he's not at his post any longer. I think we're good to fire Alicia now. Alicia Reynolds, I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. <laughs> she's just like, fuck you guys. Little wave, she's gonna go and turn it off, right? You gotta wait for her to do that, though. I think we have to wait to fire Sharon Reed now until Imogen gets... Oh, she's in there now. Oh, shit. Well, she's going towards it, is she? I don't think she's in there. But she's going towards it anyway. She just passed Jeremy Bolt's place. I can't see exactly. Yep, let's fire Sharon Reed now, quick. Sharon 11 seconds. Reed. 11 I seconds. Go, go, go. Do it. For your employment status. One, Thank two, you for your three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Come on. Do it already. There we go. Holy shit, it worked. It worked. Let's Both go. Targets down. Good. Let's Just go. Give me a second, and I'm in. Non-target kill. Forty-seven. Don't mind me, sir. I'll be escorting you around. Proceed She's just running way, out. Sir. Let me show you out. Okay, yeah, you show me out, pal. Let's go. <laughs> oh, that was great. I hope that uh, we can get out before any of this happens, right? Oh shit! Do I have to hack the data core now? Wait, do I? Oh, shit. I have to hack the data core in the middle now. Are you kidding me? No one's going to see if I subdue him right here, right? Fuck it. I got to do it. I have to. I'm sorry. I have to take you out, pal. And I have to take your, uh, your disguise. And I'm hoping that's enough for me to go down. I think this is the way in. Yep. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Oh, shit. He's going to see. No, he's not. He's not. Okay, now we gotta hack this shit and get out of here immediately. Good. You're alone. I'm seeing the room and Windows 47. Yeah, do that. No about Holy shit! That is loud. Good lord. This has been probably the longest mission so far. It's, it's been a lot you? of me figuring out what to do Clients, though. Operatives, every hit the ICA ever sanctioned, enough to shut them down for good. Okay. But first, you need to locate all files referencing Diana and yourself. Guessing I need to find the way out now. Searching. Files found. Oh shit. All resolved. feel like taking lives random disorder well we are here basic training starts at 0600 hours i should leave you to prepare perhaps i see possibility where others see limitation i choose him the two of you go way back i didn't realize that you 
I don't know. I get why you want to protect her. So, wipe all the data referring to the two of you from their system before we publish the rest. Okay. Publishing it all for the world to see. The ICA is in big trouble, baby. Okay, good. Mission accomplished. I set up a link to an information non-profit site. When you press that button, it's up there and the whole world will know. There's no undo 47. This will shut the ICA down for good. You... What we want. Really okay with this? It's who you've been for so long. Doing it. Maybe it's time for a change. Hell yeah. It's time for a change. Turn things to normal. No need to alert them we were here prematurely. Safety Detected. Well, that's not good. Shit. I missed that. We're blown 47. I can hold the doors for a little while. Use the fence to get out. Go now. The fence? Breach protocol initiated. What this fucking vents? That means they'll shoot on sight. You I'm think? create some havoc, 47. Made the core meltdown. Wait, I see vent. We'll defer their attention a bit. Warning. Core overheating. All right. Warning. I'm getting out. Shut down. This exit's locked, though. Warning. Fire detected. Oh, Jesus. Well, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. That exit over there is the one we need to go to, 68 meters away. Why is this guy naked? Oh, this is one of the guys I knocked out before. Holy fucking shit, you're kidding me. <laughs> you are kidding me. I don't even have a gun anymore. Fucking hell. This is terrible. All right, need to find an exit, boys. There's one up there, actually. 43 meters away. Oh, yeah, this is where I knocked the guy out. Yo, if I disguise myself as the board member again, what happens? Oh, they're still searching for me. Makes sense. Oh, that worked. Holy shit, that got us out for now. Holy shit. No way they saw me. Holy shit, okay. That might have actually worked for now. Need to find an actual exit now out of the whole place. Oh shit, he's still there? We can go out this way though. Let's go, baby! That facility was a nightmare to try and get out of. But we did it! Now we're out of here. Where's the... Oh, it's 50 meters above. How do we get up there? All right, this is the exit up here, boys. We made it. We did it. We're being hunted. I don't think we're gonna get five stars on that for sure, but uh, we did it. There's the train. We gotta catch the train. Let's go. Let's freaking go, baby. Ah! Come on. Exit mission. Hell yeah. We freaking did it. Let's go. I've been recording for like an hour and a half. This video is probably going to be like 40 minutes. <laughs> there was so many little different parts where I got stuck on it and I had to do over a couple of times. Definitely not ideal. Um, yeah, zero stars. I thought as much, honestly. How did I get five stars on that one one and then I don't think I've had a star on any of the other ones? <laughs> Fuck's sake. But I did the mission. I did the story missions. It's just, I don't know. We got caught out a couple of times for sure. He's not going to be happy. The so-called ICA files. The disclosure of a... You win. So. What happens now? The ball's in your court, Miss Burnwood. I do have other candidates, you know. Most of whom have never tied me to a chair. <laughs> You've seen the news. That was 47 acting on his own. He is untethered. He is unstoppable. And he cannot be bargained with. He will find you, Mr. Edwards. And I'm the only chance you've got. Why would you want to help him? 47 has one weakness. Me. What the fuck is this bitch's issue? God damn it. Thought you were with us, lady. The farewell is the... Is the next mission, is it? I think so. The farewell, and then we have untouchable or unstoppable, was it? Let's just have a quick look here. But Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. But here we go. End of an era is done. The farewell, and then untouchable. Yeah. Okay, so thank you all for watching this video. We'll be back.
for the farewell mission in the next part and it's going to be untouchable as well we're going to do one big long video to finish it off hitman 3 finale part 5 will be back at the start of the week i'll get it done before i start the medium because i want to do a medium series as well i think that should be a really fun little horror game on xbox series x uh, but yeah thanks for watching guys we'll be back with the finale of hitman next i'll see you guys then it's been my pleasure to serve you all